With the Add Sync to End Printing tool, you can import groups and users from an Active Directory controller into End Printing through the REST API. This will let you keep your group and users in sync in Active Directory and End Printing. The Add Sync to End Printing tool is a C Sharp library that is available in GitHub. Before you download the tool, you need to make sure that the Active Directory user who will run the Add Sync to End Printing tool is also an End Printing user with admin privileges. The Add Sync to End Printing tool lets you create End Printing groups and users, but you cannot create new security roles for those users. This needs to be done in End Printing. This means that before you use the tool, you need to make sure that your user roles are defined in end printing. When you create groups or users in Active Directory, you specify the user role with a suffix. The syntax for this suffix is an underscore followed by the role name. Your group name should begin with end printing. This is because the Add Sync to End Printing tool only adds groups that begin with NP. Now you will assign some users to this group. When you add a member, they must have a first name, last name, and email address. Now that Active Directory is set up with an in printing group, download the tool from GitHub. After you extract the content of the zip file, navigate to addsyncnprinting.config and open in a text editor. Before we import the group, we need to configure the tool. You will need to change the URL value to match your machine number and the port number for Active Directory. Also, you should enter the domain name and top-level domain name. Here, you can see the expression that defines which groups and users are targeted for import. By default, all groups that begin with NP are imported. If you want to use some other naming convention, you should change this expression. The last expression in the config file checks the active directory for groups that have been deleted, and then removes any deleted groups from end printing. Finally, copy the end printing server URL, enter it into the config file, and save your changes. Next, run the build.bat file to build the project. The bat file creates an executable file that you can use to run the application, which will import your Active Directory groups and users to end printing. When you run the executable file, you need to enter the parameters for the Active Directory user account. Enter hyphen u, followed by the domain backslash username, and hyphen p, followed by the password. After the executable file runs, when you open end printing, you should see the imported users and groups that you imported with the Add Sync tool. If you open a group, you can see the group information, such as who the group users are. The Add Sync to End Printing tool supports incremental load, so when you add other groups in Active Directory, run the executable file to sync with end printing. With the Add Sync to End Printing tool, you can easily import groups and users from an Active Directory into End Printing. Please subscribe to our ClickHelp channel to receive new content every week.